<gasps> no. One day I will have good lighting. first dipsy video if you followed it all and I do get excited about every single one uh, I'm really excited I put on makeup today it's Father's Day and when I get down pet sitting I'm gonna try not to get too sweaty um, I'm taking Big Daddy out for a Father's Day dinner um, so just wanted to share with you my makeup routine um, I use the Garner BB as an all over like a primer. It's not, but that's what I kind of use it as. Um, and then I use uh, a confidence eye cream for around my eyes. My foundation is the, um, the Fit. Uh, and oh, last month's Beauty Blender. That came with Etsy. Oh my God. The finish is amazing. Absolutely amazing. I I love this thing. I love this thing. And I keep it like way up where the dogs can't get to it. Um, because it's awesome. It's awesome. Um <clears throat> so my beauty blender. Love, love, love. Thank you, Ipsy. Oh, big daddy's home. I gotta hurry. Um, then for under my eyes, this is another Ipsy. Um, it's the It Bye Bye Under Eye Cream. Um, I love it. Um, and this was something that I got from Ipsy a long time ago that I continued to buy. Love it for my under my eyes. Um, the one thing I do like about it is a little bit goes a long, long, long way. Uh, and it doesn't get real creasy. Uh, I mean, because, you know, let's face it. My face has been around the block a couple of times. I have, this is, this is the roadmap to my life. The ups and downs, all of it. Um, and a couple things you can do if you don't like these wrinkles. Um, is surgery. Um, honestly, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Just saying. Um, the it cream when I when I put it on, it doesn't hide off my wrinkles, but what it does is it doesn't set into them. Because one thing that I hate is when I have on an eye um, a concealer and a foundation is later in the day I just have all these cracks. Uh, so between this and the finishing spray, I look great all day. I love this stuff. I haven't found a better one yet. Um, that one makes me really happy. Um, and then um, for my eyes, it's it's everything. I mean, I've got I've got some Maybelline, and um, I've got some of the um, oh, I love I love this brand. Um, I've got some of the um, the Bon Voyage. Um, this is also Ipsy. Uh, same with my cheeks. This is also an Ipsy. Love it. Um, I've got some Revlon, like I said. Got a little bit of, a little bit of everything going on as far as, as my eyes go. And then I'm using the Meech and Mia that I got a few months ago. Um, in the corners and underneath my eyebrows because, um, yeah. I'm coming for you, 1977. I'm bringing it forward. Um, and then for uh, my concealer powder, this is also an Ipsy. Uh, it's the Naked Cosmetics. I love it. Love it because it's very translucent, so you can you don't have to worry about adding more color to your face. It just kind of does a really good job of keeping everything sealed in place. I love it. This is another. Got it from Ipsy, and I'll buy it. Um, my eyelashes. Man, 
Big girl bang. So Ipsy has spoiled me. So first it was NYX, NYX. Uh, then it was IT. And I bought both of those because of my Ipsy bag. And now this big girl bang or bad girl bang. Um, I, I will be hard pressed to try anything other than this. I love this. And this will, because of Ipsy, be a purchase. Thank you, Ipsy. Um, for my lips, I am using um, the Koki. Got it a couple months ago. Um, it's the, the lip veneer. Why did I put my glasses on? Um, love this one. And this, you know, I, that was a sample. That's a full tube. It's going to last me a while. But I love this. It's a great all year color for me. Uh, and then to finish it off, um, the Master Fix. Uh, finishing spray. I love this. Um, and the only reason I'm using this is because of watching like other beauty gurus and seeing how um, it does set their makeup and it does um, also leave that that dewy look. Um, and that's another one for my age. It's just like let's you know let's keep it plump and dewy as long as we can. So that's what I'm wearing today. Now that you've suffered through that. Let's see what's in my Ipsy bag. I gotta put my glasses on this. Oh, I'm so excited! Oh! What do we got? It's not as fantastic as... It says summer to me, right? Good colors for me. I will let down. After the past few months, this is a little blah. But it's okay, right? Let's see what's inside. Okay. Okay. This is a uh, mitten. Mint and argan lip balm and hi with hydrating chia seed oil. Okay. From the Grove Collaborative. Um, yeah. Okay. Don't know this brand. Oh, it's like chapstick. Okay, chapstick fanatic. This one right here. Sticky. Smells great. You know how um, you know how Burt's Bees is really sticky, but you only got to put it on once. That's what it reminds me of. It smells wonderful. Yes. Okay. What's next? Oh, flying colors. Flying colors. Yup. What's next? This. Uh, Steve Laurent. This is Green Apple Eyeshadow. I'm excited about this Green Apple. I have a Maybelline that I picked up um, like this size. That is an awesome green. Let's hope that this Green Apple is kind of green and be fun to play with. Especially with my eye color. Jeez, oh Pete! <laughs> oh, that's really green. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, I am. Mm, okay. Oh, okay. So it's frosty. -y -y. Where did I put that? I cooks. Yeah. That's uh. That's gonna be really pretty. Can you see? Get my camera in the light. I think it's going to be really pretty. I, I think it's a little off-putting. Like, it's so intense in the pot. But on your skin, it's got a really, really pretty shimmer. That's going to be fun to play with. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's next? Uh, three times Sublime. Three-in-one blackhead, wash, scrub, and mask. Pink grapefruit and jojoba. Okay, I'm always down for some kind of cleanser. Um, that's my thing. I like cleansers, moisturizers. So I'm down for that. So we'll definitely give this one a try. Smells good. I'm all about the scents too. How does it smell? Yeah, it's got like the little exfoliating beads. God, it smells great. Wish they made that in a body wash. I'll have to look for that. <gasps> What's next? A new brush. Oh. I'm a brush fanatic. 
I love brushes. I love bread. I love brushes. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, it's a Luxie 245, if that means anything to anybody. It doesn't mean, all I know is it's just a brush. What's next? Ooh, ooh. Last one. Ready? Oh. Luscious lip. A lip stain. Uh, I don't know how I feel about these, honestly. Um, I, I like the, I have, oh. I got a pink lip stain from Lee that honestly stayed on my lips for three days. It would not come off. Um, this is, um, this is a bold color for me as well. Uh, I can make it work. Really, really bold. But if you put them together, they go great together. Um, so it could be a fun look. Um, so, okay, Ipsy. For kind of a blase bag, got a lot of fun going on in here. Um, I can't wait to try the eyeshadow. Big thumbs up, Ipsy. Thank you. Um, definitely can't wait for the face scrub. Another brush for my collection. And uh, I'll be carrying this with me all week. My um, mint and argon chapstick. And then, um, yeah, lip stain. So, next week, I'll do a video where I have tried out with these products that I can let you guys know exactly, uh, you know, exactly mm -hmm. the skinny on them. And, uh, that way you can see them on the face as well. See how they go with my my skin profile and their their choices for me. Um, and I'm pretty excited about it. Got more videos coming up. I got a um, video from Bonnaroo. I got another one of me and Lee being really silly and playing uh, word games. Uh, I've got an, another DIY coming real soon. Um, so hang out with me. Um, See what I got going on. Thanks for stopping by and remember, be peaceful, be kind. It's important. I'll talk to you soon.